app from the App Store today. Now, from your weather authority, meteorologist Stacy May. Well, for the early part of June, today was just about as good as it gets. Plenty of sunshine out there all day long. It was warm, yes, this afternoon, right where we should be for uh, this time of the year. But the humidity was so low, and that makes uh, all of the difference. We're going to keep this kind of weather going right on through the weekend, too. Here's live first warning Doppler radar. It is all quiet, a clean sweep across the tri-state. And it now looks like this is the picture we will see all weekend. We were a little concerned the past couple days for maybe a few showers returning at some point on Sunday, but then the data started to trend drier, and that has certainly been the case today. So now Saturday and Sunday both look dry, and it may even be later Monday into Monday night before those better rain chances really start to uh, develop. So that's when scattered showers and a few storms will be possible. And right now the severe threat even doesn't look uh, all that bad for us come Monday, but that's something that we'll watch as we go through the weekend and uh, keep you updated on. In the meantime, take advantage of this weekend uh, and enjoy it uh, outside. Here's a look outside right now in downtown Evansville from the top of Fifth Third Bank. Uh, our superior ag tower cam there on again a quiet and pleasant Friday evening. Since the sun went down just after 8 we have been dropping our way through the 70s and now down to 67 degrees and just a light breeze uh, at 3 miles per hour and there's that dew point way down there in the 50s and it was even in the 40s if not the 30s in some places uh, for much of today. Those are kind of unheard of dew points uh, in the tri-state in early June. So I know you uh, enjoyed it. We all certainly did. And we're still in that pleasant range. And guess what? We're going to stay in that pleasant range through the weekend. And then I think next week, we'll at least get back into some tolerable air. Might return, uh, kind of flirt with some of that uh, humid air, but nothing real oppressive in terms of the humidity. Just kind of back to normal uh, as far as that goes uh, for early June. So here's a look at temperatures right now. Almost everybody has now dropped back into the 60s and we're going to keep on falling with those low dew points, clear skies, light winds. Tonight is going to be even cooler than it was last night and I think at least mid 50s is where we're going tonight. So here's Storm Tracker. High pressure in control. It's keeping all of the showers and storms and most of the clouds away from us and it will continue to be in control of our weather for tomorrow and Sunday. So here's a quick look at an updated future tracker not going to show us a, a whole lot. We know that means some great weather going to continue and going to uh, come our way. So skies stay mainly clear through tonight. Heading through uh, the day tomorrow, we will see plenty of sunshine again from start to finish. Maybe just a few of those little clouds again mixing in in the afternoon. Tomorrow night, skies are mainly clear. It'll be another cool one. We'll go back down into the 50s. And again, now Sunday looks completely dry. Just a partly cloudy sky. Dry Sunday night dry into Monday morning. This latest run of Future Tracker has us dry at noon, so I think later in the afternoon into Monday night, that's when some rain chances will return. So here's your forecast for the rest of tonight. Clear and a cool one. Lows down into the middle 50s. Look at your great weekend. Sunshine for both days. Cool nights, warm afternoons, but we will keep that humidity down. Highs will be in the middle 80s both days. Low 80s then early next week as more clouds return. Some scattered showers and a few storms too. And again, the better chances later Monday, Monday night. Bit of a break on Tuesday. May see some more Wednesday. Break on Thursday. And then we'll have those chances start to go back up again on Friday. So kind of every other day next week. Not a washout any day, but nothing like that to worry about for mm -hmm. tomorrow or Sunday. Yeah, we will enjoy the weekend. Yep. Thank you, Stacy. When we come back, cannonballs christen the newly reopened public pool in Tell City, Indiana. Even the mayor joined in.